Hey, hello everybody. Welcome back. That was actually quite insane for those of you who saw it. I'm going to activate this. I'm not going to go through it because I'm pretty sure I'll find... I'll find one of them eventually again at some near point in the future. Alright. Mythic Gateway. I'm pretty sure he said the things are only uh, one way as well, so... We also got a lot of stuff. And they said we have to take it to the dwarves. And that they'd be able to do something with it. What exactly? Who knows? But... It was like a golden sword or something that was part of it as well. Which I am quite excited about. I was just about to say we should be able to find more of these dewdrops. Defense increased. Okay. Obviously the marriage to Odin didn't last. But how did Fran end up a hermit in the woods? Oh, that was a singular piece of cruelty, even for Odin. As if the marriage wasn't punishment enough. Freya was better to him than he deserved. She stuck it out through all manner of indignity, all in the name of maintaining peace and safety for her people. But Odin's madness, his tyranny, his corruption of her magics, it became more than she could stomach, and at long last she broke it off. Odin's wrath was fierce, and his curses upon her were more than she dared to fear. But her magic was so much stronger than his. After so much time together, he knew her vulnerabilities, and exploited them to craft curses she could never break. Oh, like not being able to leave Midgard. Worse still, he robbed her of her warrior spirit. Freya cannot fight, even to defend herself. No living thing may she harm by blade nor spell. In a world this belligerent, what choice does she have but isolation? Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. I lied. So would I. I wonder if there will be another Gigantimus monster troll thingy here as well. today. We're not getting in there without a key. Really? <laughs> Crap. Alright, well at least we discovered the area. We've activated the door. I really wonder how often those dewdrops reform. Because we've gotten really lucky as we've been going around the water area that we keep finding new ones. And I think even at one point, ah, jump. Even at one point, we were we like backtracked a bit, and the dew had reformed. 
The thing about the do is that every single time we get one, it, it permanently increases our strength in some sort of way. And if we can keep that up, imagine how much stronger we'd be if we could just continuously go back to these things over and over. I mean, this is of course wishful thinking, but you understand what I'm saying. I think we've increased our strength, we've increased our defense, we've increased our luck, and a number of other things. Samir, there was a shrine about a giant lady with lots of books and, and visions. Ah, that would be Goa, the knowledge keeper. She was a gifted sorceress, who gathered every tome of arcane wisdom she could find in the realms, all in the hopes of augmenting her powers of prophecy, that she might find her lost husband, Arvandil. But it was not her husband she would glimpse in her visions, for it was Groa, seeing longer and farther than any before or since, who witnessed Ragnarok, the end and the beginning. When Odin caught word of her ultimate prophecy, he maneuvered to obtain her knowledge and hoard it for himself. Groa knew Odin as a long-time patron of her services, and so she welcomed him into her library as a friend. What she did not know is that Odin himself was behind her husband's disappearance, having used his enchantments to conceal his death at Thor's hands from her sight. Smiling, jealous Odin took her by the throat, and with his very hands he stole her library and her life for his own. I always knew Odin was bad. That's just... Ruthless, barbaric, heartless? That's Odin. In fact, we would do well to sit here in silence for the next few moments and reflect on Odin's capacity for cruelty. And so... Reflect longer. This one. Strength. Yeah, see, like, th th this is incredible. We keep finding these things over and over. I wonder how many of them are littered around. How many of them we can continuously uh, use. Increased by two. Weird. Iron Cove. This is some other. Holy crap! to see where where the thing actually is. It's very difficult to see. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. Alright, this is garbage. This is getting kinda hairy. Yeah. Oh, okay.
that's always super difficult because you have to like wait for their Help chest to open. Increases resistance to burn by 50. Yeah, I like that. Here, boy. Yes, sir. Another map. Great. Would have been nice if I could. I'm an idiot. I see fire, I hit it. There was just another thing of fire here, I thought so. Oh, next not. You know what would be great? Health. I guess we have to no we can't get in further. At least I'll need to be able to destroy it. The dew hasn't reformed. I feel like a lot of these areas I'm finding are um, above my pay grade. Wow, there was another shipwreck under the water. Vitality. I have a question. If Ymir was the first giant, where did he come from? In the beginning, there was Ganungagop, the Great Void. There were no realms yet, only primordial forces. There was fire, and there was ice. And there in the void, they met and produced... Water? More than water. The mystic lifeblood of something entirely new. From this water, Ymir took form and became a being of pure creation and chaos, mother and father to all that came up. But I can just tell you this story later. That looks dangerous. That looks super dangerous. A formless substance found inside realm tears used to enhance unique properties of various talismans. And look at that. I almost ran away from it, thinking it was going to be evil. And it wasn't. We can't jump down from here. Hmm. Hmm. Can we go up? Doesn't seem so. No. Nope. Off we go. Can you finish that story you started? I can indeed. Where were we? No. Oh. Emir, the first giant, had emerged from the void, and every form of life began to spring forth from Emir. Even the Aesir? Aye. Every god, man, and beast came first from Emir's flesh. Though it was the Aesir who thought themselves so superior that they should hold dominion over the rest of creation. It was Odin who took arms against his creator and spilled Emir's lifeblood with his spear. A necessary evil, he would say, to bring order to the realms. But I can just tell you the story later. No! Crap! No, stop burning! What's up with the enemies here always burning me? And that thing 
didn't heal me at all. I have no healing, uh, anything. I can hit again. are about to pop out and that's not going to be good for me at all at all at all at all I'm afraid of stuff like exploding now Open arrow is a trick. I have a lot of world serpent scales. I have a very strange feeling. A lot of this stuff I'm getting is very uh, expensive. Anything else happens. How's that story end? Odin's spear had spilled the lifeblood of Emir, the first giant. Emir's torn flesh. Odin would fashion the realm of Midgard for his own. Called himself All Father, as if he was the creator and not the creator's destroyer. A small, covetous tyrant. Emir? Huh? Oh. Sorry, my boy. Ah. Uh, you know, I think at best we just end it there, actually. So it looks like everyone has a common enemy. I'm noticing a trend. Everyone hates the same person. I was just here. Yep. want to find a like a store now so we have a lot of a lot of treasures Before we do anything, I gotta save. Just because I'm very low on health, and I'm at the, the the point where I'm like, okay, I know if we get hit, it's just gonna be a huge problem.
We haven't found like anything for him. It's so weird. So if something punches us in the face and I die, I think it's huge. At least what we've saved. So no life anywhere. That's cool. Treasures from all different realms. You think that Fafnir went to Alfheim too? I do not know. Aren't you curious? He sounds interesting. We go to the storeroom to collect anything useful for our journey, not to learn more about the dwarf. Fafnir was a rather interesting fellow, little brother. Perhaps I'll tell you a story one day. Oh boy. Where is this leading us? Something. Armor huh. piece? Oh, I hope it's a new armor piece. We found a lot of crap. Hundred Acer's gold. Where's that thing that we found? We found that that like that weird sword thing that that giant dropped. Hmm. That was incredibly weird. I was all excited to find a store to figure out what that thing was. Oh, that was not too bad. Rune goes down by one, but the defensive vitality go up. I can't do yet. But they also make me weaker. It's kind of weird. Hmm. Fine piece of work. It, if I say so. Myself. Hmm. 
increases stun, exposes weakness, aim shot, barrage. Hmm. Thank you for being an appropriate size. Hmm, what shall it be? I don't have enough equipment. Brings out my runic, put my strength up. Same. Oh, ah, don't have the 14 embers. Hmm. I mean, sure, why not? That was amazing. Hmm. Oh, I'm not gonna be too bad. That'll come in handy. <laughs> Get it? Was there more? Let me think. I'm still perplexed. That I can't sell that stuff. Must have gotten here first. I see the raven. Come to me. happening in here. Looks like we ruined a party or something. See, those are all the monsters that keep exploding, keep popping up. Guess that's just what the game is now. Locked to CRN.
this is where we have to go. Can't honestly tell, a lot of the area looks almost exactly the same. Ah, yep, that's where we tried to open it. Gotta find the thing on my jigs. Atreus, follow me. Sorry, I got distracted. There's definitely something bossy in here. Whoa. Use entry stone on the pedestal. Boy. Another map. That will find something useful here. Looks like the Reavers made it inside. I hope they didn't take all the treasure. Expectations low, boy, and you will never be disappointed. Key to able to get to the final <laughs> one. They Is caught you off guard. I wasn't expecting them. Exactly. came from. Monsters are far stronger than I'm used to. That's the word. Yeah. Oh, of course, the 
TV trying to turn itself off. I can't hit him too close to the poison because I'll get hurt. Oh, he regenerates his fucking health. Where we came from, it should close, and now they should open. I have a good feeling about this next one. Maybe we'll even find the what's done. Remember what I told you about expectations, boy. Keep them low. I remember. Still, so good feeling. Ah, is this another location? What's the trick in this one? Holy crap, she's strong. See other stuff over here. Yeah, what are the world serpent scales for? Must be some type of an update or something. Or an upgrade. I was ready for them this time. Good. I saw. So I should keep my expectations low, but always expect an attack? It is a delicate balance. Expect the worst, assume nothing, and always anticipate an attack. Sure is a lot to remember. I assume this one will be the craziest.
enemies. Should be all of them. We did it. Which means there's a big enemy that's going to be in here. Too easy. Got a treasure chest over here. Uh. Anything else? Things are gonna come back to life. I can feel it. Back to piss on my corpse, you ungrateful little. Uh, who are you two? We're looking for a whetstone. Have you seen it? Aye, there was one in this room. My son sharpened his dagger on it, right before stabbing me in the back. What? Little bastard thought it was his turn to lead my crew. I was hard on him, sure. Hmm. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. I did the same thing to my dad when I was his age. He killed his own father? Where is he now? <laughs> he may be a bastard. But he's my bastard. You'll get no help from me, fool. Then his dagger will help. Hey! That's mine! Hey! Come, boy. We are leaving. Watch out! Over behind you! Ah, oh, crap. See anything, can't see anything, not trying to die. I can't get I need to knock this thing out first, the thing in the sky. Yeah. Alright, come on. way of trying to kill us. Alright everybody. It's gonna do it for this video. It's it's really funny. He he tells you not to get your expectations up, but you still think that at the end of the rainbow there'll definitely be something there for you to pick up. Uh, thank you all once again for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.